Everyone says aim for a 1 to 3 risk reward ratio, that your profit should be 3 times your risk. But I analyse 6,000 trades and that decision can cost you profits. Here's why. I ran the numbers. 6,053 completed pulse flow signals, grade A setups only, 90 days of data. The question, what happens when you force bigger profits? Here's what traders do. They risk 5%. Everyone tells them to target 15% for that 3 to 1 ratio. Sounds smart, right? But look what happened. They could have had 8%, 7.9%. But then it reversed and stops them out at that 5%. You've just turned a winner into a loser because you waited for that 3 to 1. Meanwhile, the trader taking profit banked profit. So what ratio actually makes the most money if your win rate is above 70%? I analysed 6,053 completed signals, average stop 5%, and here's what happened at different profit targets. 2%, 77%, 3%, 66.8%, 5%, 51.7%. The bigger your target, the fewer trades reach it. That's obvious. But you think, I know how to beat this. I'll just tighten my stop to fix the ratio. If you tighten your stop to 3%, you destroy 82% of your winners. They never had room to work. Look at the time data. Average winner takes 8.6 days to hit 3%. Only 16% hit within 24 hours. That means you're sitting in trades for over a week, eking that extra 1%. Is it worth it? Faster profit, higher win rate, better returns. The maths doesn't lie. The 1 in 3 rule isn't universal. So just know your numbers. Please subscribe, like and share and I shall see you in the next one.